All right, ladies and gentlemen, Rob St. Clair from Volleyball Source with victorious Argentinian middle blocker Agustin Loser. 3-0 win over Italy, Agus, congratulations. You played in Italy this year, a club for the first time. What was it like just now playing against, for example, Paolo Poro and a lot of the guys that you played with or against this entire club season? Okay, first, thank you so much. It was a big victory for us. It's important to start like this, this tournament. And you, you, you know, like we need all the points for the ranking, yes. for the Olympic Games and everything. So it's, it's important. And it's amazing to play against them. They are, I play also, I play only one season, and, but they are like my friends. I, had, I have a very good relationship with, he, with them. So it's, it's amazing playing against them. It's a little bit bad because one have to win and the other to lose, but it's okay. It's, this is the sport and I'm happy to, to play against them. So it, we, we've covered the Italian league all year long, and we, we really see all the players, and even this, this Italian team that you just played, even though they are so young, we understand what kind of players they are and what kind of team they can be after the season of club. But you guys, this is about as good of a team as Argentina can field, I, I think. And it looked like you guys had a level of preparedness, like you guys were ready for the Italian matchup that maybe they weren't so ready for. Does, does that make sense? Did you, did you feel really prepared for this matchup? Yeah, I think I, I can speak about them, like about this the, their preparation. But we were very, very ready for this match. We we knew that it was an important match, so we started like 200 percent. Also, uh, we played before to come here. We played Cuba. two against Cuba, two friendly matches, and the first one we didn't play good. So this was like you know a, a shock because we didn't expect that. And the second match we did better. And we say, okay, this is the, the way that we need to work to yeah, to to play. And I think we we were very re ready for this match, and we we show it in the in the game. Do you think you playing the middle blocker position, blocking against a Paulo Poro? Do you think that give that does that help you at all? Knowing Paulo Poro, having seen him, having played with him, do you, does it make you more ready to block against Italian offense? Yeah, of course, it helps because. You know, like, like his characteristics, you know, like his, the, the way that he plays. But also, he knows about me, and he knows maybe if I wait or if I jump more with the middle blocker and everything. So uh, it's help to me. It's it's a little bit help to me, but also for him. So that that's the, it's good, you know, because you know the other guy, and you say, okay, you are you are doing to do, you are going to do what you kn know how to do, or you are going to change because you know. Like yeah. this, you know, we, uh, this play of a strategy is nice. That's very fun, <laughs> especially middle versus setter is a very fun uh, style matchup. Um, yeah. What's something that you personally are working on in your game this summer with the Argentinian team? We are training a lot the service. I think it's service. an yeah, it's important. It's very important in, in this level. Uh, try to to make to the other team play with the ball exclamative or far to the net. Uh, and yeah, after of, of course Marcelo Mendes is a, a coach that he likes a lot the attack and service. We try, we are training a lot that, but also everything we try to study the, their team and block defense. Uh, nowadays it's important to to be complete team and also like. Uh, we're excited for the next match against Brazil. Argentina versus Brazil is always an incredible game to watch. So congratulations on tonight and good luck with the next one. Okay, thank you so much.